Hello everybody. This is Phyllis coming to you. Yes, Phyllis. I don't know if y'all see my whole dress. Y'all already know. Look, y'all know I might have to suck this stuff in. But it is what it is. But the word says, love. I found this when I got off from work, took me bath, and then when I found it in my laundry basket. I hate laundry baskets, but it was in there. I don't like baskets, but for some reason, they, they find their way, clothes find their way in there. But anyway, check this out, y'all. Y'all know my motto, okay? I always gotta come at y'all with something, and today something gonna be take the band-aid off. Band-aid! This band-aid, let me tell y'all something. Let me just mention this to y'all. Band-aid. Y'all ever had one of them band-aids when y'all were growing up? That's when we had them band-aids that was real strong, that was real tough. They were tough, they pulled off your skin, right? And I was listening to something that was very motivating for me today, this morning. I was listening to it. We got to be prepared to take some pain. We got to be prepared to take the pain. If you're here in this life, we're going to go through pain. We're going to go through it. So you got to be prepared. That's why I said take the band-aid off. Y'all know when I was growing up, y'all know this. We had the strong band-aid, y'all. We a bit of up years old. We had them band-aid that really hurt. So that means you already know it's going to hurt. You already know. Ain't no doubt about it, y'all. But then you get some friends. Y'all ever got some friends? And then, for some reason, we always want to come up with the count of three. On oh, the count of three, pull it off. Now, we already know the pain is coming. We already just sitting there, okay. And then you got some of these friends that won't wait to three. Y'all got them kind, don't you? Don't you? You got the friend that won't wait to three, and you told them to wait to three. But when they snatch it off, or when you snatch it off, notice. We have to snatch it off. If you take it too easy, that means the pain is going to be worse when you take it off. Now, this is a little, little small band-aid. This is a band-aid that ain't like we had growing up, but it still hurt. Our band-aid took off the hair. So, I was putting on, I thought about this this morning. Ow. You see, this is kind of strong band-aid, y'all. So I'm intense right now. I'm kind of intense. Now I know the pain got to come. I know it got to come, but I gotta get it over with. I gotta take this band-aid off. <laughs> I got to take the band-aid off so I can heal. I got to, and I gotta take it off, y'all. I didn't know it was gonna stick like this, though. I really didn't, y'all. For real. I didn't know it was gonna stick like this. <laughs> oh God. On the count of three. What? Y'all, no, I ain't no hair on this one. Um, that kind of hurt it, but it wasn't, it wasn't as bad as it was when I was growing up. Y'all see my little mark right there? It left a mark. It, might, it left a mark. But guess what? It's over with. It hurt it. But I had to go ahead and I had to hurry up and take that. I went on ahead and took the pain. I took it. It is what it is, and I snapped. I, it is what it is. Sometimes we have to take that pain to be able to heal. But you know what? Trouble ain't going to last always. It's not going to last. So go ahead, get it over with. Go ahead and guess what? I'm going to get bruised again. And I'm going to have to do another band-aid. As long as I'm here on this earth, I'm going to have to be using some band-aids, y'all. It is what it is. But it's how you handle it. How you handle going through it. And believe me, sometimes y'all might see me on here crying. Because I'm going through something. I mean, I'm a person. I have emotions. I have uh, uh, affection. I have tea. I don't know where the heck affection comes from, but I have it. I have it all. I'm just like a human being. Anybody stop looking up for everybody else to give you all the answers. They're human just like we are. They got to go through the pain. If you don't go through the pain, you never would succeed into your goal or anything in life. 
if you just keep on walking by it, keep on walking by it, and never want to exist, never knowing that it exists. But guess what? It's still pain. You're still hurting, but you're still trying to say, oh God, I don't want to go around that. I don't want to do that because I, I, uh -uh. I that's going to hurt a little bit too bad. But when you get it over with, you feel so much better. That's something Tyler Perry said about people trying to hold on to houses. I don't know if anybody ever heard Tyler Perry, one of his uh, uh, speeches after one of his plays, and it made a lot of sense what I was going through. When you're trying to hold on to these houses and these cars and everything, and you study stressing over, and you study stressing over, and it's painful. It's very painful, y'all. Very painful. And I'm sitting there going through the same thing with mortgage, going through it with bills. Well, you know we got to pay the bill, but some of that stuff we don't have to hold on to. Some of that stuff we hold on to for unnecessary reasons. We really do. I know me. And when he was saying, this is what you do. When you stressed over your house, when you stressed over trying to keep what you got and everything, move. I never thought about what Tyler said. I said, move. Yeah, it's just that simple. Move. When that pain is over with, when you find out, when you let it go, you feel a whole lot better. <laughs> I'm going to leave it with you. You feel a whole lot better. I know. I know. And I know you all know. Don't worry about what people are going to say. The way you feel is the way you feel. And don't worry about it. Let me tell you. Like I said, 80% of people don't care. The other 20 is glad it ain't them. <laughs> Snatch that band-aid off and get ready for it. Because it's coming. It's coming. And, and if you take it slow, that's just how much pain you're going to have to go through. You're going to have to go through more pain. So you might as well just get it over with. <laughs> and stand tall and say, I'm ready. I'm ready, Lord. I'm ready. I'm going to go through this. But I'm going through it with you, Lord. I'm telling you, the divine God, he loves us. He loves us. And we might rock a little bit like that, but he say, oh, I got you. Come on, get your stick on back up. I got you. <sighs> if he took Joel, do it. What you think he'd do for you? <sighs> Joel lost everything he had, y'all. He even lost children. But guess what? Job still stood tall. I ain't going to say I can be a Job. I would like to be a Job. No, I ain't going to say I won't be a Job. <sighs> I don't even know if I want to take that battle. But that's a good... Bible story, somebody want to go through and listen, go through and read or go through and hear, go on a uh, uh, phone and audio, go listen to it. If you don't want to read it, just sit there and just listen and absorb it in and you'll find out, wow, Joe went through that much. God did not bring us here to have us suffering all, all the time, all the time. We choose, we choose our battles. So it's up to you what you are intending to do. But on that note, check this out. I wanted to show you all this. Life is too short to be serious all the time. Y'all know my motto? That's my motto. That's what I say. That's what it is. And y'all, don't forget right here, the little bitty word called faith. Come on, we got to hold on to that faith. And on that note, y'all, I'm finna go and know that God loves you, I love you, but he loves you a whole, a whole, a whole lot more, okay? And I can do all things through Christ strengthens me. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Oh, don't forget, subscribe. Subscribe, y'all. Subscribe. Like. Comment, hit that notification button. Hit that notification button, yeah. And put your mind to it is the channel. I was going to read these cards, but I got to make some more up for you all. But it's put your mind to it. P-U-T, your, Y-O-U-R, mind, M-I-N-E, to, T-O, it. 
some reason I came up with that name, and I think that name's going to stay. Put your mind to it. You put your mind to it. You can do anything that you put your mind to. And know that on that note, I'll holler at you later. Okay? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Bye.